Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of Enter the Gungeon. Are we going to do better this time? I don't know. I don't know. That's a fair question. It's a fair question to propose and it's an, a question I cannot provide an answer to yet. I can, uh, I can give you my hopeful answer and say, hell yeah, we're going to do better. But judging by the fact that I lost my shield to the first enemy I encountered on this run, I would say that we are not going to do well. But uh, you never know. I mean, sometimes you start off doing really poorly, whether it be in uh, Gungeon or Isaac or any game that revolves around, you know, you completing a run, for lack of a better term. You, uh, you start off, you know, um, doing poorly but then you're uh you're able to pick up the slack for the remainder of the run and you do well and sometimes even better than if uh if you started off playing really well you know or you know sometimes you start off performing really poorly and uh it carries over for the entire duration of the run the next thing you know you uh, that's just how it is. Hang on, I'm going to adjust my mic so that my chin doesn't bump into it. Sorry about that. Um, we don't have enough for anything at the moment. So we're just going to go this way. There's a chest up this direction. Excuse me. And you know, I, I'd like to mention, um, and this is entirely unrelated to Gungeon, it's actually about an entirely different game, but I would like to say that, alright, so a little, a little background knowledge before we dive into what my opinions are on it, um, EA has released Madden 19 for the PC, okay, and that's something that people have wanted for a while you know i think the last madden game that was on pc was uh was uh madden 08 if i remember correctly so it's been a good 12 years i think since uh we've had a madden game on pc and you know with that being the case i decided to go ahead and purchase it because i wanted to to uh get in on it because that's something I've been wanting for the past few years because um, you know I don't always have access to a console um, and frankly I don't like using a console I prefer using my PC play games in general uh, PC master race but uh, you know yeah so I've, I've been I've been hoping for that to come along and it finally has and by the way, I, I have not purchased it. Um, I picked up Origin Premier Access, which you pay, I don't know, $15 a month and uh, get access to a lot of games and play them as much as you want without having to buy them. Um, I think it's a pretty good deal. And it let me get in on Madden 19 a week early, which I am happy about. Um, so I, I started playing it and I got into a game and trying to control your your players and uh, just trying to play the game in that in that aspect uh, aspect anyway god my voice is uh, is going out on me I need to get some water here shortly um, Probably if I die here. Yeah, I'm going to go get some water in a second. But I'd like to finish this anecdote first. Um, you know, it's just, it's god awful trying to control, uh, trying to, you know, control your players in that game. God, why do I keep doing that? I'm not paying attention. That's why. Um, you know, it, it's so difficult trying to trying to control it because the key bindings are poor. You know, your arrow keys are what make you move. 
and you know sprint is left shift and uh, you know if you're passing the ball it's like Q and E and R and F and it's just you know that may work for some people but the way the finger placement works it does not suit me at all and I'd like to change it but they don't give you the option to do that um, and you may ask well why don't you just uh, you know, use a controller that's made for PC uh, why not, you know, why not just do that? Thing is, is that I, that I have two of them. I have two controllers that are specifically designed for PC use. One is off-brand, one is, no, um, you know, I don't, I don't know what the brand is necessarily, if it is Microsoft, um, but one is on-brand, I know that much. And, uh, it, like, neither one of them work. <laughs> on my uh on my pc i don't know if it's a an issue with my drivers or something or just my version of windows 10 but um uh, neither one of them work you know if you if you so much as touch the cable they no longer function at all um and that's problematic tr trying to play with that i i i could give it a shot I guess but I doubt it's gonna work because it, it, it hasn't worked for any game that I've tried um, you know but I'm desperate here I, I, I really hate playing that in key bindings I have come to learn um, I mean the game itself is fine it's just I, the, the key bindings are something that I cannot wrap my head around and they are not something that I can get used to. Um, I just, I need better, either better key bindings or a controller to use. I don't have either one of those things. They're both 360 controllers, by the way, which may be part of the issue, but I, do, I can't see why that would be a problem. Um, unless it's Microsoft intentionally doing that so that you get the latest um, or use the latest technology from them. I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, we are going to look around for the shop because if I can buy a shield, then I would like to do that. What's that? Got to be down this way somewhere. I don't lose any more health in the process. Shop was down there. I didn't see it. It's all right. Picked up a few more shells. Yeah, I know you stole it because... Uh, because I left it there. I didn't need it. All right, bud. Can't buy anything. Uh, it was worth it just to look, though. So I'm I'm satisfied. All right, facing Bullet King again. It's uh, it's Star Wars. Got a. Got a gun from Star Wars. Fun fact, I don't know if I mentioned this at all at any point, but I have never seen a Star Wars movie. Any portion of a Star Wars movie. Actually, I take that back. I think I think I've seen the first five or ten minutes of A New Hope. I think that's what I've seen. Um, but that, other than that, I haven't seen anything. And we got through that without losing any health. Holy shit. This gun is amazing. Um, but yeah, we... I, I, I haven't seen anything. Basically. Um, and we got a, a health upgrade. Um, you know, and like... I, I've told people that and they're, and, and they're like... What, are you kidding? You haven't seen 
Star Wars. And like, I know. But, oh, there was a key in there and I didn't take it. Alright, well, I think... No, we don't have one. Great. Awesome. Amazing. Um... God. Um... Son of a bitch. I'm trying to conserve my ammo here. Um... You know, but it's like, I, I, and the thing is, is that I, I have, um, I have the, uh, the Star Wars movies up to, I, I, I have the first six that came out. I don't have any of the newer ones, um, but I have them on Blu-ray. I just haven't sat down and watched them. And that may not make sense to people, but not really an issue of uh, of time it's more so an issue of uh me not remembering that i have them available to me um okay i would can't afford anything sir but i would gladly come back if i have more shells um or i will gladly come back if i obtain more shells Running low on ammo for this gun. I have to resort to the Molotov launcher, which may not even work the way I hope it will. Another key, free of charge. That's what we like to see. This run is actually looking really nicely. Or it's looking really good. You can't you can't describe a noun with an adverb, Luke. That's not how this works. I know. I like to think of myself as a connoisseur of the English language, but uh, <laughs> maybe not. Um, actually, go back and pick up that gun since we're low on ammo, and I don't want to use my Molotov gun. That seems like a gun that's uh, that's one or one that you should save for a boss. So we're gonna take that back. Oh, there's no teleport. It's fine. Let's walk all the way back. Um, now, one of these days, I should probably watch Star Wars. Uh, just have not gotten around to it yet. Okay, so we have a camera now. I'm assuming that that stuns enemies. Um, that's what I'm thinking, anyway. Go then. I have anywhere to go? Oh, maybe we do. Is this some kind of mini game? I don't know how this works. Um, so I'm just gonna pass. Very much. Of course, I'll learn that it was probably some amazing thing that I should have taken advantage of, but. I can do about it. Live and you learn. I have to live and I have to learn. My own experiences and through my own mistakes. But you don't learn anything when you make mistakes. You just repeat the same mistakes you always make. Listen. I didn't say that. To receive criticism in response. I said that to encourage myself and give myself a little motivation, okay? Alright, excuse me. What I would like for you to do is get away. We need ammunition. We are in dire need of ammunition because this water gun 
is not great. It's something, but it's not great. Thank you, thank you, thank you. falling for any of those traps it's not happening oh all right i imagine shooting more of them is not going to do anything well i mean unless he stays in one place the entire time in which case maybe dead no i'm so close i'm so close i am not dying now fair we 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 messed that up for ourselves to a degree um so i i guess i can't be too bitter about it but i i am bitter about it <laughs> um we are going to leave this episode here it's a a little on the shorter side but i want to keep it that way mainly because i want to go and get water and i don't want to <laughs> to do any sort of uh major editing not that, you know, cutting out some, uh, some dead air would, uh, would be a lot of, you know, editing whatsoever, but I just, I just go and get my water in between episodes. That's what I want to do. Um, so with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this episode of enter the gungeon, let me know down in the comment section below. Like the video and share it with your friends. Let me know you want to see more of any game series I do here on the channel. The link down to the game is in the description box down below if you want to pick it up for yourself. Subscribe to my channel for more gaming content. I play all sorts of games on my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you very much. And I'll talk to you later.